Hey all, Binks here, excited to play some more Balotro. Uh, we have three wins in a row. I have a great attitude and a delicious glass of oolong tea. Mm-mm. Uh, you didn't miss anything. We started a green deck run and then my dogs went psycho. Uh, the run was going okay, but we're gonna start a new one on the green deck. Green deck gets no interest, an extra dollar for kept hands and an extra dollar per kept discard. I think it's a very, very powerful deck. Uh, and we will go ahead and take our first fight here. We only need a 10 for a high straight. I think we can take some discards to go for that. Queens. I think we probably aim for our flush because this flush should be big enough to get us over the top. Uh, and then we're going to get $7 here, I believe, if my math is correct. So you usually have a lot more money early. To, uh, we have to take Madness. We simply must uh, take Madness. I, I, I see no other path other than going Madness. Madness is a very interesting Joker. It gains 0.5 molt every every turn, but it destroys the Joker. So you, you build your run around this card. We can leave it by itself, and I think that it will gain molt no matter what, which is really good. Uh, two molt cards early is just, just really, really nice. If I remember this correctly, this will continue to grow. It will continue to grow if I have no other jokers. So really nice thing to get early because uh, this thing is going to get absolutely out of control how big it is. This should get close to winning. Close, but no cigar. Sevens and threes should get us there. I think no problem. It's really interesting on this deck. You, you don't want to be discarding nearly as much because you get paid out for your discards. <laughs> The dog problems continue. Free money? We, we always take free money here. I don't think driver's license is going to be worth it. And we have to remember, we kind of have to save money to buy a bunch of jokers at once. Because if we just buy one joker at a time, it just gets eaten. So we kind of are just going to let this vibe and get bigger. Probably open like celestial packs. Try and get tarot cards to get our base that can get multiplied even higher. Uh, but when we want to start buying jokers, we have to buy a bunch, uh, at least two, two, two at the same time uh, to defend ourselves. Fives and sixes should just get us there with the upgraded full house, 2x. Very nice. Uh, so this is a great, I mean, it's a great early joker to get, but we're, we're going to have an interesting start to our run, I think. Maybe we just kind of hodl and gain money. Maybe we take like, start, maybe we peek at some, some packs. Uh, polychrome queen, don't mind if I do. Molt Tarot 5. Unbelievable card. That seems to be a good choice. So this just getting multipliers, as long as we're getting some okay Celestial packs, it's pretty good. Uh, but at some point, we're going to have to pivot and go really hard in um, trying to get uh, a bunch of extra Jokers so that we can start to have just one Joker die at a time and keep f like four other Jokers. You can't get... Uh, you can't fall in love with any other jokers except for madness when you have it sometimes in like later runs or higher stakes You, you have things called eternal jokers uh, Which will not be able to be destroyed So sometimes you can get like madness and then four eternal jokers and you're, you'll be in a really really good spot The bonus cards are good, but two raid and terror cards could be anything You know, it could even be two bonus cards and two mold cards and steel it looks like we, we won that uh, For certain maybe one reroll here the interest doesn't really matter. You're, you're very used to like caring about your interest level, but uh, you, you don't have to worry about it nearly as much. We already have a 3x molt going here. Go for a diamond flush. Seems like the correct play, if you ask me. Also throw these molts down. We're not going for diamond or clubs, uh, but we have the same amount of each. Uh, let's let's cut these. Uh, you're kidding me, huh? You're, you're going to do this to me. Aces and eights, I don't think is going to do it. Even getting to a 6x, I think we need the, the diamond flush for that that high base multiplier. Uh, brother, you, you got to give me something. You, you got you to gotta give me you gotta give me another diamond, man. Okay, let's get some uh, Empress going. Uh, we can keep this 9 as a steal. Then we'll play this flush. We lost a bit of money there. I mean, we, we spent all our discards. It doesn't feel great. Maybe we didn't have to go that hard. I mean, we're getting 40, 4,600. Uh, maybe, maybe we didn't have to go that hard. I'm, I'm not quite sure. I guess, I guess we're flush-pilled right now. Flushes are pretty easy to get early on. 
Uh, let's hodl some money here. All spade cards debuffed. Don't care. A cheeky diamond flush should easily get us over the top here. Bro, brother, you, you gotta give me a diamond. Like, when, when you fold this card for like one card and you miss it once, understandable, right? You know, you're taking four shots in the deck usually for, for a single suit. It failing is is just, just something that happens. When it happens two, three times in a row, boy, oh boy, does it get me mad. Uh, we have a 3.5 molt coming here. Full house, I think, is good. Uh, getting a little bit better and then let's keep adding cards you know we got really lucky with our first two standard packs and then we get three cards that do absolutely nothing uh this literally does nothing on this <laughs> on, on this one uh, i don't really know what i'm rolling for we should really just be trying to get as much money as possible mega celestial sounds great uh we can get some like kind of base ones going okay so let's let's take a full house and then let's get our two pair a little bit a little bit heftier so that if, if we're stuck just having to play a two pair the three and a half molt is, is going to be a lot more uh popping let's skip for two common jokers I, I i think that we keep playing every time we play this gets bigger so we honestly we should just keep playing i, I this gets us there I, I, no doubt i would imagine some doubt i i'm now at the point where i have some doubt if that would get us there because it, it certainly didn't aces and fours look like with the steel kicker uh, let's just let's just fish for diamonds Keep the steel in hand it paid off. We probably shouldn't have kept the steel in hand uh, But it did it did help us there We're gonna have to start getting jokers eventually because just this just scaling is, isn't gonna be enough Here is okay. Maybe we could just keep upgrading our deck. I don't know uh, It's not good enough I don't really like like holding for random planets. I don't think it's that good. Plus 50 chips and a gold seal to help us get more. The steel is also tempting, but uh, that, that's a wonderful card right there that you want to play just about every time. Uh, one in seven cards drawn face down. We're at four and a half molt. Queen, jack, seven, eight, nine. Let's take a discard. Let's go for an eight or a king. And we got our king here. Our straight isn't upgraded, so this probably won't be all that great. Let's get some more face cards bonused. Make them nice and strong. My doggos are are, are are very feisty. Very feisty indeed recently. I guess we can go for a full house. Uh, we have three queens, so let's keep that to be the one that we go for as a potential. Okay, we actually know what this card is. So this is an interesting thing. In... So we know that it's a club. And we know that it's less than a six or more than a five. This is a six. You, you can figure that out if, if you... Uh, an early thing they have to know with these discarded jokers. If you mess with the suits in the ranks and you also look at, like, the order of them because uh, it, it shows them top to bottom which order, you can figure out cards a lot more than you'll give yourself credit for. Uh, two jumbo buffoons I don't think is quite my tempo. Let's take a three of a kind so that we don't uh, get super embarrassed by, by losing, uh, trying to take that again. I think we go next round. Let's, let's try and save up until, like, let's play two more rounds here. Let's play two, I want to take the Mega Iconic, but let's play two more rounds, save up as much money as possible, and then buy a bunch of Jokers so that we have our Madness base. I think that's the way that we're going to play it here. I've never had early Madness before. I've taken on Madness late, uh, and it was very strong. But I've never had Madness early. I'm going to put the Polycarp with the back. I don't think it matters right now, but just for... Uh, the fundamentals. I, I think it's important to start remembering to do that. And the problem with like madness is that like even even our five X is pretty good right now. But you know if we're taking a lot of time to to get each Joker or, or to finish out each round, it's, it's going to be tough. So we can go for two sevens or we can go for three hearts. I think we go for three hearts here. It might take us two discards, uh, but we get it in one. Very nice. And this should get us over the top, saving five extra dollars. And again, we're, we're going to skip the next one, I think. Uh, we'll take a full house. We'll, we'll buy what we can in the shops, like Arcana Pack, full house. And, the, and then next time, we're just going to pretty much buy any Jokers available. Just just grab any Jokers that they, that they will give us, I, I think is the way that we're going to play it. Uh, let's get these bonused up. Pretty much just try and fill our Joker slots so that we have some some ways to move things around. Okay, three tens. Do any of these have an extra card in the deck? 
three fours, three twos, four sevens. We have an extra seven in the deck, so let's uh, go for an extra seven. We'll cut the steel card. The steel card's nice, but it's going to hurt our discard ability. Uh, and I think a flush is is going to be the pivot here. Oof, we have ten jack, king, queen. Uh, the flush pivot's going to hurt. We're not going to get nearly as much money as we wanted here. Unless we can get this in one with a molt card. Upgraded flush. Still not going to be all that close. Kings and fives might get us there with the crazy flip. This might be... Not what we're looking for. We get there. Okay. Okay, so now our goal, buy jokers. No matter what's available, you buy it. Ceremonial Daggle also, also destroys Jokers. Which makes me really not want it. We're getting to the point where we need help. Oh, okay. Actually, getting a random Joker is, is exactly what we were looking for. Tarot card Joker is great. We will take a Celestial Pack. Uh, we'll take another two pair to try and make this not as bad. We will take this. We'll re-roll. The... Uh, Riff Raff is very nice. We'll buy. When a blind is selected, when blind is selected. So I believe they should go left to right. So it should create jokers and then destroy jokers. Would be my hope here. We really don't want the Riff Raff to die. So now, now we have jokers that this will eat. And we'll just have to deal with it eating a joker at a time. Not get too held on and just try and have the best jokers in hand available. The Ceremonial Dagger basically does nothing, which kind of sucks. But it was just to kind of get us there. I think we actually legitimately just sell it for three because this is going to refill anyway. And hope that this doesn't go first. I, I don't think it should. A, a wild card is actually really good for us. Uh, and it's going to help our fortune teller, which we're not going to get attached to. No, we're not going to get attached to. So they should go left to right. So Riff Raff should do and then Madness should eat. Okay, it immediately ate my tarot card joke. <laughs> ah! Okay, plus 10 molt if we get a flush. This should always go on the right side. Uh, the Riff Raff is actually really great for Madness, though. It's, it's going to help help us be very, very fast and loose with, with what we choose to do here. Uh, and we are, I, I, you know, I think that uh, realistically we're digging for flushes, but we could keep three kings in hand. Uh, no, we cannot keep three kings in hand because we don't have any discards. We have zero discards. So let's play a pair of kings. As well as these, and then we should get a, a heart, and then we should have a wild card to, to finish things out. Uh, okay, we don't even have to play this wild card. We, we'll hold it, right? Because we might not get enough here. We don't really have anything. I guess the plus 10 will probably get us there. Let, let's be honest with ourselves. The plus 10 getting molted to the freaking moon should, should get us over the top. Uh, and we are slightly flush pilled just because of how many uh, flushes we have been taking. So with Riff Raff, we're going to add two Jokers. The one's going to eat. Until Riff Raff dies, I think that that is our engine right now. Uh, create food, uh, keep whatever best one, get two, and then have one die. So I think Juggler, thank you for your service. You're gone. And then let's just buy our Arcana Packs, Standard Packs. Try and get the deck stronger so that we're not relying on our Jokers. We wanna, the big thing is we want to be relying uh, on our cards. I, th I think is pretty big. Two Planet cards or a Steel. I think Steels are quite good. This so will take a, a Steel 6. So we can get Molt from our cards, Molt from our hands. I mean, I think you have to take Foil, Foil, Steel, Gold Seal 2. That's a darn good card right there. Uh, maybe we take a reroll. Maybe we just go next round. We just go next round. We can still have this wild card that we can play. Only one hand is going to be a little scary, but we should be able to get 11k, especially if we get a nice uh, grouping of Jokers here. So hopefully the Riff Raff doesn't die. It's going to be a 1 in 4 every time of the Riff Raff dying, and that's going to make us have to adjust our game plan. There you go. Okay, uh, three of a kind, and we got the Juggler again. So again, we're looking for flushes because we have the Droll Joker. Why do I say things, chat? I, I asked myself this many a time. Whole house goes kind of crazy, but I mean, we really want a flush because of the Droll Joker. The, the flush basically wins it for us, right? Uh, and we could just get a, a wild to get a flush, right? Yeah. Let's take a let's just take a wild jack here, and then use this to get our flush and save maximum money possible. Madness is at six and a half molt. Uh, money's on sale. Pong. 
Now we kind of want good jokers, right? Square joker, I think, is kind of trash. We can take it. I mean, a lot of these are trash, right? Let's let's be honest with ourselves. But I think we can reroll and get some, get one that maybe we want a little bit more. Lucky six, steal five. I think having a, a lot of steals is is always good for any deck. Uh, we got a molt four, a super molt four. Let's let's take the super molt four. Do we just take a regular molt five? I think we do. I, th I think we do. I think we're okay with having a slightly thicker deck. As long as all the cards that we're adding are, are net benefits, you know, like Molt is really good with our madness. Obviously, it's gonna gonna scale it to the moon. So there's the economical play, which is take this Joker and just don't care if it gets eaten later. Or there's a reroll play to try and get a better Joker. Take a reroll. Plus fifty chips of a pair. Welcome to the team. I don't I don't love it, but 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 you're you're a part of the team whether I want you or not. Okay, uh, double your money. It's fine, but we want to keep getting this madness scaled. I think. We lost our best joker. <laughs> ah, okay, 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 okay. That was a really good one for us. That was by far the one that we didn't want to lose. And nothing else gives us molt. We need to find molt. Because I can't discard this. We're going to need this molt. Uh, we need we need, we need, need base molt. And I think a flush with the foil 5 should be enough. I wish I could get a tarot card out of this. But I think I, the 10 molt turning into 70 molt uh, is going to be the way that we win here. And we even get the extra chips for the pair joker. Yeah, we just have to remember we still have to make sure that we have uh, enough money to, to be getting on to the next round. Okay, we'll go Jackson sixes. Might get us over the top. Nice. Okay. Madness, you screwed me again. Baseball. Baseball's very good. Get it on the team. It's going to give this an extra one and a half molt, which which kind of gets us over the top. Uh, we don't have anything that molts in our hands, so we need Celestial Pack to get stronger hands. That's not going to do it for us. How do we need to guarantee 11, 11k with one hand? We might have to reroll for another Joker. I think we need to reroll for another Joker. Maybe just get a bunch of steals. Maybe a bunch of steals could help too, but I think, I think you have to take a Purple Seal bonus. Take one reroll. Move on to the next round. This is gonna be scary. This is gonna be scary. Okay. We have a flush. I think flush is our best hand. A full house is our best hand. We absolutely are going for full house. We have a full house. We have a full house. Let's see what this looks like right off the bat. So full house is gonna give us 150 extra chips. We're gonna scale the molt to about a hundred. That just gets us there. Don't even have to think too much. 43k. Okay, very cool. Uh, the unfortunate thing is that that, that kind of screw, screws us over. Um, the no hand one, because that's how we make all of our money. Uh, we will take a spectral pack. If we can, like, polychrome this, we'd probably sell everything to polychrome this. <laughs> Maybe. But the, I don't know. Maybe. We'd think about it for sure. Where's cards to a single rank gain minus one hand size? Uh, we lost our juggler. One random card, three enhanced face cards. I think you take that all day. Enhanced cards are, are just very good. Jumbo buffoon, or or I, th I think we take a jumbo buffoon as opposed to re-rolling. Um, number of times poker is played to the molt. Spectral extra chips. Create a tarot card if hand is played with three dollars or less. We could get some tarot cards out of this, but I think we do need some base molt. Is un no, it's uncommon. This being uncommon makes it just a very easy play with the baseball. It's going to add an extra one and a half mold. Uh, do we want to hang, man? We already have three dollars, so I, I think we just move along. I could just get eaten right away, right? Okay, the wall is scary. I could just immediately get eaten. Okay, that one wasn't that big of a deal. So no matter what hand that we play, uh, we're also going to win in one hand here. As long as we get like a full house or a flush, maybe? Flush might get us there too. Four of a kind, flush, full house. All probably just get us here. This three of a kind with the ten molt probably actually just wins it for us. Almost, almost certainly this wins it for us. Let's just take it. Max money here. I don't think we have to worry too terribly much about trying to like dig for tarot cards. Each one of those costs us a dollar, so uh, I don't see that being as, as super worth it. 
Uh, ride the bus isn't great. It is. It's not uncommon either. Let's take some celestial packs. Get full house even stronger. It's a little hard for us to get full houses, but uh, it's not not impossible. Let's get her straight out of hell at, at rank one, and then let's just, let's just take a ten and a four Joker here. Uh, we, we actually do want to reroll for Vegabond. Ooh, should, probably shouldn't have done that. Next round. Mega Buffoon, not necessary. What are you killing? Okay, you killed Vagabond. So we just spent that reroll for nothing. Og. I was like, this is like already in suit order. What is going on? Okay, we'll take our discards here. We have this incredible card. Uh, so we just need a diamond. A diamond with the flesh with the steel kicker. Do you want to glass anything? Particularly, glasses are a little bit scary. We don't really need it for like this hand, right? There's nothing to keep in hand that we would glass. So let's just hold it in hand right now. This flesh should get us over the top. We have a 10, we have a four. We have extra chips, 50K, not too shabby. The madness is going out of control. Scholar seems fine. I think we just get, take Scholar, double Arcana and try and save a little bit of money here. Obviously, uncommon jokers are, are generally going to be good for us. We should probably be taking... Oh. Sorry for the dogs. It's pretty tough when my partner's not around. Uh, they get very annoyed when I sit here and look at my computer, as I'm sure many people uh, who have dogs can relate. I don't think we're going for spades or anything like that. It's super important. Let's just gold up a card. Call it a day. Take another Arcana pack here. Wheel of Fortune is pretty nice. Or we could just take two Taros. I mean, Wheel of Fortune hitting anything but the Madness, it's going to get eaten by the end of the run. So I don't see that as being that big of a deal. So let's just glass up an 8. And then let's take a uh, two tarot cards for use in the next battle. Extra mold cards is great. Glass cards, kind of whatever, but but we don't mind it. And let's move along. The wall is going to be hard, man. Especially if we lose Baseball card, we might lose here. Okay. With Baseball card... Whoa, man, this is the only one that Baseball cards... With baseball cards, we should be fine. Uh, we might need to really push for full houses, though. Lots of queens, lots of kings, lots of aces. Aces are even better. So let's just dump all our, like, non-faces aces. I hope that we can put together something special here. Two fives. With five fives remaining. I hate to, to see you go, Molt 4, but let's, let's get you guys out of here. Okay, we're gonna take our last discard, which is a little bit iffy, but Jackson fives are, are pretty likely. Uh, we'll go ahead and turn one of these fives into a glass five. We molt two of them. I think we'd rather just molt both of these. I think we'd rather just molt both of these. We'll keep a glass for potential later needage. Um. We get plus 50 chips, we have a really high base, plus 9, and then plus like 12. I don't know if this will get us over the top, but it puts us in an okay spot. It does get us over the top, 87k, very nice. And the madness grows, the madness grows, chat. Extra discard, must buy. Uh, This joker is just fine. Getting undiscovered jokers is kind of nice too, uh, I would say. Let's take both Arcana Packs. Hermit, really wish I would have <laughs> taken an Arcana Pack early. Temperance gives us nine, this gives us six. Nine dollars isn't too bad, but getting a second Hollow is, is really good. Getting a second Hollow is just really strong. Let's just take Base Molt to like make all of our cards get Base Molt. Having all of our cards get Base Molt is pretty good. So having one additional Hollow or two more Molts that we can use in battle. I think actually still one base hollow is, is uh, might, might just be better than it. The the 10x is really good. Convert the left into the right. Uh, let's use that. Now fours are looking pretty strong for us. Uh, stone card. I think we just take nine bucks. I don't think stone cards are, are really in our game plan currently. Uh, with 12 bucks, I think we just go on to the next round. We just went through the wall, so nothing's going to be really close. Uh, to where we were. That was probably the best Joker to lose. I, I don't even remember what it was. That's that's how little I care about that Joker. 
is that I, I, I honestly do not remember what it was. I think we keep a queen. We have a lot of queens. Uh, we got a bunch of fives, man. Uh, still not glass anything, really. I guess, I don't know, maybe we'll end up getting close. Maybe we just take a, a cheeky glass five here as, as our, our, our final card. Make sure glass goes after molt. We're playing a steel card, but eh, it's whatever. I think we... We should have put our queens after our... We just got 350,000? Just got 350,000 there. That's uh, that's really good. Probably just a lusty joker. I mean, anything that just fills a space and is okay is is certainly worth taking now. I think upgrading our flushes, uh, getting them to the point where we can win with them is, is pretty nice. I think another standard pack too. We've been getting pretty lucky with these. Another good four. Uh, it looks like we have quite a few fours. Seven fours. Fours and queens. And fives are kind of what we're looking towards right now. Do we take a reroll? No, I think we just take the hearts joker and be prepared to use it. Remember, put face cards after non-face molt cards is very important. Or hearts. Uh, or maybe it'll it'll just get eaten and it won't matter. I, I, don't, I do not know. Lost well, Scholar, so aces suck. Great time to draw three aces. <laughs> Uh, just a regular full house, I think, is, ju is just, like, all we need, honestly. Like, our, our full house, the level is already so high that just multiplying it by 10x is, uh, is pretty wild. This is a cool run, man. Extra discard. I mean, even if this gets... When the blind is selected, I don't know if I'll get the discard. Uh, this is an uncommon, so we'll take it, and we're about to open a Celestial pack, so we can get, like, a 0.1... 0.1x molt added, which I mean is like a whole additional round of molt. It's not nothing. It's, it's not much, but it's not nothing. Let's try and get two pair to be reasonable if we're forced to play that. We'll take a standard pack too. Gold, ace. We have a lot of fives. Uh, let's take another five. We already have seven fives, so like getting fives uh, is really good. Okay, immediately eat the celestial. That's fine. We just bought it. I, I wasn't held on to it anyway. Let's take a big flush here. Okay, first king gives 2x win scored. Uh, order doesn't matter because all we have is spades. Base molt being halved is actually very relevant. Base molt being halved is, is very relevant here. Uh, that hand sucked, man. That wasn't that good. A lot of fours, a lot of fives still in the deck. Only three jacks two aces six fours man four or five mm, keep the steel four or five keep the steel four or five Ugh. we almost screwed ourselves there quite a bit uh, I don't know this looks good 100k, not too shabby. This is the final this is the final round, huh? We're moving on to anti-8. Spectral pack. Take a spectral pack. Five random cards gain. These are all not great cards. These are all not molted cards. Just murking five of them sounds wonderful. Let's see what that affected our deck. Fives are now the best. Fours and queens are second. Sixes suck. That's kind of it. We just, we just ate everything. I think Immolate is really good, man. Every time I see Immolate, I'm, I'm very inclined to take it. Gold Seal Queen. Molt Double Trigger Red Card. We only have four jacks, but... Molt Retrigger with Photograph is really good. Oh, we can take two, huh? Let's take a, let's take a bonus queen. Bonus queens are nice. 12 molt of three of a kind. That's, that sounds great for us. We play a lot of full houses. We have a lot of money because of the emulate too. So you can re-roll. Double tag, probably unnecessary. We, let's look at our blind. Oh, we don't see the blind yet. 300k. Okay. Violet Vessel is, is no joke, man. Very large blind. 300k. I think we played twice to get this up. Lose our lusty joker. Not a huge deal, but not a not a small deal either. 
keep threes and fours. Uh, and take our threes and fours with a steel kicker. Hearts in the right spot. This extra mold should really help. Jesus. Okay. We have to get stronger though. Like we have to really invest to make sure we can beat this big blind. Especially if we lose like baseball card, which has been so clutch for us for so long. Uh, Hermit's nice. Another red seal. Yeah, I mean, you, you kind of have to take that, in my opinion. Convert the left card into the right. Oh, I don't want to lose a four. I'd much rather lose a nine. We have we have we have quite a few fours. Uh, convert the left card into the right card. Get another red seal molt jack. They can also uh, re-trigger photograph if if it stays around. I think we try and go towards our top end. So like flushes are quite likely, and four of a kind are quite likely. We will take a reroll here. Uh, let's get fortune teller in. If fortune teller can survive, the plus nineteen molt is crazy. Uh, one consumable slot isn't really going to do anything for us. We'll go next round. Please don't kill the tarot card. Baseball card is actually probably worse. But we're not ready to have that conversation. Um, I need a two or a jack. I'm I'm wondering if this gets us there with a double triggered 2x super jack. You know what? We, we want to discard for a tarot anyway, so let, let's take one discard. Hongdman. Want to discard for another tarot? We could, but I, I think this wins it. This must. If this doesn't win it, I will freak out because we're in a lot of trouble. <laughs> uh, what do our twos look like in the full deck? You want to get rid of any of these cards? Twos are like fine. Tens have five. I would cut a two and a ten if possible. Yeah. Okay. 280k. Okay. So we kind of need something like that to take our big line. We're going to roll all the way down. We're going to spend everything. It's an uncommon. I want this because it's an uncommon. I We don't have baseball card anymore. That's a great point. I think we can set this up, especially if we roll for an Arcana stuff that does it. I think we can set this up and this is how we win. Um, Jumbo Celestial Full House would be great. Okay. Standard pack. Not worth it, in my opinion. We're gonna reroll down. A wild card goes crazy. We could upgrade any of these and be completely okay with it, uh, if at all possible. Pair three of a kind. We might need these. Honestly, let's just buy them. I don't think we're getting much out of an extra reroll pair. I sleep. Campfire, it's too late. Literally, literally just simply too late. But 12 mole for three of a kind, three X mole for three of a kind, I think that. Uh, we can't buy it. We can't buy it. It's very close. I, I think that speaks for itself. Um, let's go next round. Select the blind and then get a game plan once we know what Joker we, we don't have. Uh, that was Photograph. We should be fine. We have 19 Molt. If we can set up a full house with Flower Pot active and the trio, I literally do not see how we lose. Okay. These queens are iffy. Because they're all diamonds. I can wild one of them. Which means the only thing that would kind of screw us is if we got another like spade or diamond of these two. But that's not a huge deal that we're super, super worried about, right? Okay, so we have... Okay, let's just think about this. Four, four, four. Right? We have extra molt too, so we can put the queen afterward. Oh, the photograph's gone. So we have diamond, heart, spade, and this can be our club. We don't have photograph anymore, but we're still going to be trying to be as smart about this as possible. Heart, diamond, spade, club, queen, full house. 3x, 3x, 12x with a 20 kicker. Should be it. 
Let's go! 1.5 milli, baby! Great run there. Um, Madness is cool, dude. Uh, a lot of people get very scared of Madness Joker. Unless you have a very set game plan, I think Madness is crazy. Uh, Madness got to, what, 12x molt there? Super fun card. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed this run. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. Balatro has been amazing. I really appreciate you being there. I'll see you soon.